Within esports, it's incredibly easy to overlook the importance of a team's name. But in an industry where symbolism and flashy branding can be this influential, a team's identity is crucial and it's undoubtedly the first tool used for connecting an organization and its fan base in a meaningful way. It's truly exciting because it seems like the Minnesota Rockers seem to be bringing a new meaning to leaving us in the dark. Remember to drop a like and subscribe before we get into this interesting story and stay tuned. So the 2019 Call of Duty World League team names were leaked on the Call of Duty League website. It was actually data mined within in the files of the website and what was found was not only a massive list of team names but also team colors coinciding with those names and even a few locations in the new franchising league for call of duty esports so all of this information was indeed found within the website's coding very very soon after its official launch there were actually like many interesting names coming out of this leak and it left us with not only team name info but also a huge reason to be excited for call of duty esports in 2019 some key names that were drawn from this leak were the rocker which this video was centered about optic gaming and even phase clan so there's a lot of subject matter here to dive into if you were looking for the full list of leaked team names well look no further we have the seattle surge chicago huntsman phase atlanta minnesota rocker dallas empire los angeles gorillas paris legion london royal ravens los angeles optic florida mutineers new york subliners and toronto ultra so a lot of these names locations and colors really did prove to be exciting for fans because now we can put a name to the face now we could draw many many things together and draw conclusions based off this information now obviously today we are going to be diving into the minnesota rocker and in specific they identify with an ultra dark violet color which is absolutely beautiful and many fans are connecting to a sort of dark and stormy name choice that they came up with given the minnesota heritage as well as the actual name rocker it seems to just fit it perfectly Perfect. And interestingly enough, in an article ranking these leaked team names from worst to best, the Minnesota Rocker sits comfortably on Dexerto.com in the top ranked half, and on Luckbox.com, it was actually given a rating of an A+, and that was actually the only leaked team name to receive such a high rating on that website. So it's kind of needless to say that this is a very strong start for the Minnesota team and their branding in general. The way that this color coincides with this dark and stormy team name actually has speculators compartmentalizing them into a dark horse figure in the COD esports world because it's directly linked to Twilight and sort of a metaphorical end of the world in Nordic culture and an identity like this is not to be overlooked. Many fans feel connected to teams that serve a clear and defined role in esports and in this case it seems like Minnesota may have found theirs in an incredibly strong way whether they know it or not. Now diving specifically into the name Rocker it's undoubtedly a dark and mysterious one but what's not a mystery is is the actual source of the name, believe it or not. Minnesotan people have embraced a Nordic culture, like I said previously, in nearly every single sports-related avenue that they can. And esports isn't going to be a stranger to this tradition. The name Rocker refers to the old Norse word to mean twilight or growing dark, perfectly fitting the branding of a dark horse mentality. In such a cold and on the fringe of darkness-stricken culture, any embracement of an idea of the world ending or having a dark presence can definitely serve to connect Minnesota, their fans, to this team like glue. Connection is is absolutely key in order to build an organization and to also build up the fans with the organization so now the minnesotan people as well as anybody who identifies with that culture has a, a symbol you know a status having something to relate yourself to is an incredible asset as a fan and as a team the minnesota rocker is without a question a unique and meaningful name that will not only serve as a symbol for an up-and-coming dark horse team in the cod world league but also as a potential contender for a, a juggernaut not position in the 2019 league you know you see these gigantic teams who have a very well-defined role in their esports ecosystem with the switch up to franchising it's it's interesting to see a well-executed team that has the potential to thrive in the new location oriented atmosphere so not only do they have this dark and stormy role that they're playing in esports they're also gonna seem to thrive in this new franchising league it's great to embrace new ideas now the question going to the fans is do you necessarily think that this name is gonna stick do you see the minnesota rock being the supposed dark horse it intends to be and will that name and will that role serve them well in their pursuit of the six million dollar prize pool please i implore you to join the discussion below make your opinions heard it's going to be incredibly interesting to see what the fans think so i'll pass it off to you do you think they have what it takes or will you pick a different route as a fan